Belly TV, and I'm back again tonight to you all with some doggone Big Lex Baddies collection. Now, I must say, Big Lex was funny as usual, uh, calling the girl from We're Old and all that crap. Y'all know she come with the antics. But I would have to say, like I said, I enjoyed this episode because she is sending some of these girls home. They need to go, like, right now, like today. Um, I think it was Nyla... Then you had a couple more of the girls who they put up. Each person had to put three tallies. Y'all know Queen D and Lucky and the other girl, they're new. So they was not up for elimination. And Big Lex went off on all the girls because she feels like they're picking on Queen D. Now, y'all know Queen D be popping it, saying this, saying it. And she feels like, you know, Queen D is going to be her. She's going to say what she want to say. But y'all not going to be ganged up on her. It's not going to be the gang up on Queen D show. Now, if you all do not know, Lucky, Lucky like Hustler, so and Queen D off the GP of the day, she actually will let the girl just be getting um, Probably and more than like any of the other girls. On the side of um, that, were on Queen her D show or anything proved like that, to be they asked how bad it. she wanted to be on this show. Um, If y'all seen Queen D... Online, like Big Lex was talking about, y'all know Queen D pop up stuff on Instagram all the time. But the girl worked really, really, really hard to be on the show. I seen it with my own eyes. She really deserved to be on the show because she wanted to be on there more than anybody. Now, why she was not picked as a star person or a first pick as coming on the show, I don't know. But she was picked as a replacement, maybe to surprise these girls when they thought she wasn't going to come. But boo-hoo, baby, she's there. So, you know, Queen D, like last episode, she came in fighting everybody and all of that stuff. But, you know, Tori was on the phone with her mama. And uh, she was telling people, you know, I'm on the phone with my mom. Can y'all not cuss? And allegedly, I guess Queen D said something like, you know, she was going to say what she wanted to say anyway or whatever. So, you know, Tori looked at like she was in that fighting spirit once they left the club. Um, and she wanted to address Queen D. So I think that's why, you know, Big Lex came in her room and kind of talked to her and gathered them all up because she didn't want all of that to go down, I believe, between Queen D and Tori. Now, of course, everybody got upset that they were put up for elimination, but I do believe that Bunny needs to go as well as Naira. My first pick would be Bunny. She's just been there. Just period. She ain't been doing nothing. Like, and Naira, um... The proper stuff and all that is cute and everything, baby. But I don't think this is the show for her. Um, as far as China, I actually like China Cash because uh, I find some similarities because I'm the type that I don't really talk to females like that. Um, the talking that I do here on this YouTube channel, probably the most that I do to people besides business-wise. So um, I can see how she's kind of chill and stuff. And Huckleberry D was saying, you know, I feel like, you know, you kind of sit back in the cut. You don't really mix and mingle a lot with the girls. I'm just now seeing some of you since one of your friends came in. Now I can see, you know, sides of you or whatever the case may be. That's because she has familiarity with these girls. She already see how a lot of y'all crossing up on each other. Look what happened to St. Hannah tonight. All of these girls was hanging around her all the time. But y'all was the first ones to go up there and put a slash by her name. So why would I be mixing, mingling it with y'all and all of this? Y'all already probably hating by the way that she looks. And so her mixing, mingling just puts her up for a uh, grab for elimination at the same time. I don't know. She probably was going to be put up anyway. If she go hard, she's going to be put up. If she do the less, she probably going to be put up. But I uh think... That China Cash is one of the kinds, like I say, that sit back real quiet and observing and be waiting on somebody to pop off. And she's going to show y'all everything that you want to see. But um, she said that she was going to warm up a little bit. I don't know if Big Lex is going to give her another chance. Um, I don't know, but my picks would be definitely Bunny, number one. And Naira, I think Jayla deserves to stay. China, definitely say Hannah, baby. Say Hannah got up there when Big Lex asked her, you know, why you feel like you should stay, or do you have any last words, baby? She said a speech had everybody clapping, baby. Let's say Hannah stay. And then they faking on say Hannah. Like I said, everybody been up under the girl being her friend, and say Hannah been getting more camera time than anybody. I don't know if they know that. Probably know that now, but as far as them being on the show, they like say Hannah ain't about nothing. She's not doing nothing, baby. Say Hannah been all up in that camera all season. So I don't know what it is. But they weren't feeling St. Hannah. So she ended up getting into a fight, y'all, with uh your girl, Big LaRue. Now, you know, Big LaRue was one of the people that voted for St. Hannah. 
And say Hannah was popping her stuff. She was kind of directing it at LaRue as well as other people. But LaRue was like, you know, you said it coming at me. You ain't coming at these other people. They went and got up in the mix a little bit. It wasn't nothing but like a little 10, 15 second strap. It was nothing major. But hey, whatever it was, they did what it did and it got over it. So we got up to the point where Big Lex was going to actually pick the girls that were going to be going home. And of course, the episode ended. So we're going to have to wait to see who she's actually going to send home. But y'all let me know down in the comment section who you think should go home. Because uh, I am agreeing with Big Lex. Y'all trying to pop off and jump up on Queen D, baby. Y'all got girls that came in that house that y'all let slide. Y'all let Lucky come up in that house and y'all didn't do nothing. Why is that? Is that because y'all was cool with her on Instagram or in the past before she came on the show? The only person Lucky got into it with, I believe, was Tori. And then whatever that was about, it was about Lucky telling her, telling Tori to clean her stuff up like she was the room cadet. But it didn't have anything to do with her coming in the house just thinking she finna get comfortable. Now, when the girls, the sisters came in the house, it was World War Three, baby. They was ready. Everybody was lit. Jumped the girls and everything. Lucky came in. You could hear a mouse biting on a piece of bread. Queen D came in. They all went doggone crazy fighting her. The other girl came in, the new girl. Nothing was said. So, yes, they do have their picks and chooses. So, like I said, I enjoyed this episode. I think Big Lex read the room very well. And I guess we'll have to wait till next episode to see who's going to actually be going home. But y'all let me know down in the comment section who you think should go home. Make sure you click that like button, comment, and subscribe to Famous Reality TV. And click that notification bell because you already know this is about to get real. I'm finna call my home and get us home. No, <clears throat> not yet. Not yet. You got your hair done clean? Mm-hmm. Okay. Look at them juicy lips. <laughs> this is so juicy. Mario. Hey. so cute. Queen, your makeup done? Nah. No makeup on my face. Straight back. Oh, you better than that. You look cute. Babe. Thanks. I try. <laughs> yeah, they be, yeah, they been real nosy, y'all. <laughs> What's up, y'all? 10K for Queen D. Thank you, Ari. Queen D, you heard. <clears throat> <laughs> uh, 10K for Huffle. <laughs> they said the reunion over. Yeah, yeah. it's over. It's over, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't over the guy says it's over you heard hey Cleet. <laughs> 10k queen yeah everybody call me 10k queen you heard is that the end of What's the day up, hey made the best motherfucker win you heard you know hear you queen your skin is glowing thank you i got that best lean on <laughs> Where you the man? <laughs> queen, queen you got that what on best lean <laughs> you look like a whole bunch of girls. Queen put up. that motherfucking Vaseline on her face. That bitch said, "Slip and slide, ho." <laughs> Slip and slide, do it <clears throat> Yeah, the reunion me. is over with y'all. We already had the reunion, y'all. Thirty fights. <laughs> Period. Everybody call me Ten K Queen. That's exactly <laughs> what the fuck I'm trying to walk out with. You're. <laughs> <laughs> they said the reunion gonna be live. I don't know. Hell no. Mm. Your body language speaks to me. What time? You, what, what time? Your um, you supposed to be rolling out? She said she's gonna call the peoples at four thirty. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! The hey, comments is they crazy. Me. Oh, that money that I posted today on that picture, y'all, that's, that's not the 10K. That money is just regular. That's just Queen's money that I just had. Like, that, that ain't no, no, no 10K. That money that I posted. Listen, don't put your face on the camera. Why? <laughs> that's just, there go. That's just what's his name? Like, this is just Queen money. Queen money to splurge. It's fun. You heard. <laughs> Mm. Thank you now. Get busy oh. with it. <laughs> okay, Queen. That's a bad end. Let me talk Queen a little less. This ain't yeah. no fear, no drink, gang. Period. It's just, you know, <laughs> money for me to spend. You heard? That's what I had in the picture. You heard? Period. Yeah. 
Is that the ones with 10K? Then y'all just tripping like hell. We don't know. Yeah, we don't know. Yeah, we don't know. Yeah, we filmed already. Keep telling y'all this. <laughs> <laughs> mm. What they say? Um, oh, thank you for the badge. Oh, I got my thing back today. Did you? Mm -hmm. Mine ain't gonna never come back. I'm just scared. It's a big, <laughs> big fucking queen. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. You better, you better have showed your motherfucking ass mm -hmm. for you. your wig laid? Do I, I look nervous? That. I probably am nervous. I'm probably shitting in my pants right now. But it's cool. <laughs> Queen of mess. They said life's gonna be lit as a bitch today. Because I'm ready. Big three. For any. Thing you heard, I'm gonna just stay quiet today. I ain't saying shit. Action, mm -hmm. action speaks louder than words. They say Queen not scared her sister coming. <laughs> you right. Y'all right. Y'all better get smart with your fans. They crazy. Y'all ain't film yet. <laughs> Victory, I love you, Fatty. I was already on the big three first season and shit like that. And you already know. <sighs> Hi, I be popping on each show I go on. So pretty, yeah. And y'all gonna see me on it again. You ready? <laughs> yeah, I don't think nobody could really take me out my spot. You gotta be. A, what's this thing? You gotta be an exuberant bitch to take me out. Sorry. Hmm. Haven't met one of them hoes yet. <clears throat> Yep. We on the west side. Put your face in the camera. Who, me? Yeah, how good they said put your face in the camera. They want to see you. There you go. <laughs> I better show oh. up today. You know, my bullies. Okay, no problem. No problem, no problem, no problem. Great. I'm going to try my best, y'all. Hey. If Queen don't win her fights and I get my ass up, everyone, I want y'all to know. I tried. But I mean, I, I'll be tired of y'all, like, you know, always trying to say, Queen, you got beat up, you got beat up. Listen, hey, I'm taking on a case. I, I got something for these hoes, though. Okay. I'm about to walk in like a funny bitch. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. I guess so. Ah. Uh, fuck. I'm waiting. Patiently. <laughs> I'm bored. Well, thank you. Make sure y'all tell Lex y'all about one to Tell <laughs> <laughs> um, Yeah, yeah. you <laughs> so my signature windmill. You want to show it to Janet? I mean, I'm not going to windmill no bitch. I, I don't have no time. No, he no. said they probably yeah, he want to show you his. Yep, I got a lot of fights now. Yeah. Nice. I thought you was going to be in Atlanta. Where you at, babe? <laughs> hey, Johnny, Johnny. Hey, Johnny. Nice Johnny, wind it up. Wind it up. Wind, wind it up, Johnny. Wind it up. Wind it up. Wind it up. Wind it up. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but it up, I, I, I do something a little bit better now. You already motherfucking <laughs> know. <laughs> Don't play with you. But nice to meet you. Queen D, I'm Johnny the Baby, the, the motherfucking diamond cutter, what they call me on these streets. Yeah, most definitely. Um, nice to meet you, too. A 9 to 5, if you want to link up at any time, I know you was, like, talking in the comments. You know, my sister, she out here. You heard? <laughs> Period. All right? We ain't docking no bullets, dodging no bullets. I told you, you can't fight me, baby. But you can fight my sister, though. Because you're not on the show. And she ain't on there, either. And they don't want mm -hmm. her to come in. So... You can't come in either. <clears throat> Unless you help <laughs> your friend. Because she did lose. She she lost a couple. Okay. I ain't doubting her. I don't know what she's going to bring to the table tonight. But, hey. It is what it is. No, I'm just, I'm just letting you know. You was the same one talking under the comments. Don't be scared now. We live in flesh. Live in flesh now. <laughs> Ah, she funny as fuck, bro. 
I'm just saying, like we live and flush. Live and flush now. Mm-hmm. Who next? <laughs> My thing is that y'all y'all be talking in the comments. Y'all be talking like y'all sitting in the gangster. If you wanna be on season three, just say that. Say you wanna be on season three and that's why you wanna fight Queens. But you're not on the show. You mm. I have bodyguards. You are not able to put your hands on me. Okay. But <laughs> you can find my sister. Queen she got water in the for days. They can't out here with smoke. I need you some liquor. Let me. So yeah, yeah. Ah. Mm hmm. Yeah. 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 Queen, yeah, you so fucking funny, dude. They gonna be too Tony. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not the sweet voice over. Gonna drink an energy drink. <laughs> Bitch need power rates. <laughs> God. Like, uh. <laughs> Finish the goddamn. Woo! <laughs> oh, God. Hey, Quita. You better put them back on their back. Okay, no problem. <laughs> You there, but you really can't fight. I know I can't fight. Oh, I know. Go queen, go queen. Go queen. Go queen. Thank you. Hey, buddy. Hey, I'm, queen. I just said, I know I can't fight, and I'm going to put up one. And if, listen, like, bitches want to toss my salad, I'm going to toss. Not we going we gonna to toss. We going to keep it. We going to keep the tables turning. No worries. I'm not worried, bro. We good. We good. Hello. <laughs> go ahead and do something that y'all go ahead and do it. Do it. Do go it. Go here. Go here. Do it. <laughs> You're ATL, Anybody that wanna hope. party with me after is gonna yeah, we popping out. Fold it deep. Yeah, anybody wanna party? Everybody anybody wanna party after? Like we could definitely party. We wanna invite sweet dreams. We wanna invite um Tori. We wanna <laughs> invite all y'all. Like, come on. <laughs> Come on, pop out, pop out at the after party. Come on, we good, we Look good. We about to see work. each other. I'm gonna give a good invitation. Oh, and now they don't want pop out. They must be scary, yo. Friend of me, friend of me, any me. All these next next just wanna be a mini me. All these next next just wanna be a mini me. All these next next just wanna be a mini me. Friend of me, friend of me.